Good morning. Hello. I thought today I would do a chill vlog. So I'm trying to vlog more. And yeah, today is just like a really chill day. Um, I'm going to edit most of the day and then my family member is back in Palmerston North. So I'm going to go see her today as well later on after visiting ours 2 to 8. So I'm going to spend morning and afternoon editing. And as you can see, I've got zit stuff all over my face because it's that fun time of the month. And my face is just like rebelling against me pretty much. I've got so much stuff to edit because I filmed like three videos yesterday, three videos the day before. And then a couple last week as well. Um, wait, was it last week or the week before last week? No, last week I was away and sick. So it would have been the week before that. So I need to edit all of them. And then hopefully once I've got some of those edited, I can get back to my three a week. I'm really looking forward to it because I've just got so many ideas. And I want to get all these like videos out. But it's just been like a battle with my life right now. And I just have not had the energy or been in the mood, you know. But I've got all these ideas and I need to start uploading three times a week so I can start pumping them out before they are irrelevant. I've got so many like looks with new palettes and stuff I want to do too. Why does my tooth look weird? Has it moved? I feel like this looks different. Hey, she's making us juice this morning with our flaxseed oil. And I'm gonna have a tea. Craving tea. I've been on like a tea buzz lately. I guess that's not really a new thing though, is it? I, I love tea. So as you guys know, I've been drinking tea me tea for like the past year now. And they reached out and wanted to do a little another um, sponsor segment offer you guys a little discount code again. So I'm more than happy to share that with you because I really, really like their teas. The code is SHAN20. So I'll write that down below the information website and stuff. If you want to get some money off, um, they sent me this new one. It's got like proper tea bags, which is cool. The Focus, which I like this. I've already gone through, I think I've gone through one of these ones, is it? And I've definitely gone through a Profit. And this is a new bag of the Energy and a new bag of the Relax. And I've tried some of this before. Sometimes I just put this in, like I don't really use um, detox teas, but I just like the taste of this one. This one here has got like oolong tea, lime leaf, ginger root, rhubarb root and stuff like that. But if you're interested in that kind of thing, they do have that, but... I just kind of mix them sometimes, like I'll put a little bit of a couple in because I love the taste of tea. You can sweeten them if you want, but I don't. I just like the taste of tea, as I just said, so I thought I'd have one of these today. The Profit one's really good. Maybe I should have this. It's really good for your immune system. Like, it's like got a whole lot of ingredients in it, which are really good for your health. So stuff like green tea, peppermint leaf, goji berries. Like, I love green tea. I love peppermint tea. This one's so tasty. And then what else is there? The Relax one, as you would guess, is for like relaxing. So it's got some of those good ingredients. Peppermint, lavender, chamomile, lemongrass, stuff like that. Really good before bed. But I don't have that one as often because sometimes I have like this kind before bed. Peppermint tea, green tea and stuff like that. But I still like that. And then energy, as you would guess. So this one's got oolong tea, yerba, mate, I don't know what that one actually is, goji berries, lemongrass, peppermint, ginseng, so that's cool. And then focus, and that one's got plant-based caffeine in it. My favourite thing that they do still, because you can use this with absolutely any tea, um, but obviously it's perfect with their teas. This is a strainer and they sent me this one and I'm obsessed with it because it's even bigger than my last one. This one is 600 mil. So that's like two cups of tea, which is really good for those of you who like tea because this kind of acts like one of those thermo flask kind of situations. Like it keeps the liquid so hot. Like honestly, if I put boiling water in here, I keep the lid off for a while to cool it down before I can drink it because it has such good like heat insulation. Um, but it's double layered, so it's not hot to the touch. And then it's got a little strainer in it, which you can see just there, and that pops out so you can clean it and everything. But essentially, you chuck in your tea down here, put on the strainer, and then you can pour your water through. And then as you drink, it strains it for you. So you don't have to use one of those fiddly little, you know, strainer pocket things, which just end up falling apart and you get little bits all through your tea and it's just disgusting. And that's why I never used to drink like loose leaf tea. I used to just stick to tea bags. Um, because that was such a pain to make, but yeah, this is really good. Honestly, it's like the best thing ever and you can take them with you. Like I take these on like my nail appointments. My nail lady even wanted one of these because she saw it and she's like, what is it? I need it because she loves tea as well. So there's that and they come in different colors too. So yeah, don't forget about my code, SHAN20, 20% off on timmyblends.com. So 
So today I did a teaspoon and a half of profit and half a teaspoon of the skinny. I like the sound of those blend of ingredients. One serving is only one teaspoon, but I did two teaspoons in this because it's like technically two cups. You know what I mean? I love when you put the water in and all of these like blow up into huge, like the ingredients basically hydrate, I guess, because they're all dehydrated at the moment. And it's so fun to watch because it looks like seaweed is growing in your drink, kind of. <laughs> that sounds gross, but it's cool. I'm just low-key hoping that some of the ingredients in the skinny tea are good for when you're bloated and feeling like crap, because that's me right now on my period. <laughs> oh man, today is actually the worst. Like, the weather outside, I wanna go show you. Oh, this lighting though. Um, it is, crap and it is supposed to be summer you can never tell how bad it is it's raining so much heavier than it looks freaking pillows are blown around too it must be windy last night jeez okay i'm gonna show you it's probably gonna fog up my camera yep i just want to show you like all the tea watch it unfold it's so entertaining see it looks kind of like seaweed <laughs> it keeps going and eventually it kind of just like goes all the way low it's starting to float up it looks so gross. I love it. Oh, hi. Hi, baby boy. I love you. Yeah. I love you in your ears. Yeah. Yeah. What? <laughs> and then once you've drunk that, there goes 600 ml of your daily water intake as well. And then I like to drink a couple of these a day. But usually I just use my big bottle. But I bought this when we were in the car the other day traveling. 1.25 liters. So I've just been reusing it. Because I feel bad using, um, buying plastic bottles without reusing them a couple times. But yeah, 1.25 litres, so I drink a couple of them a day, that's two and a half litres, and then usually I have a couple glasses of tea as well. Always herbal tea though, I don't just go for like, English breakfast or anything, you know, I love herbal tea. So, I'm gonna go enjoy this, and then I'm gonna chat to you later. If any of you guys have tried tea, let me know what you thought down below from any of my past little sponsorships and discount codes, I'd love to hear your opinion. I hope you guys like it. My juice. It's so good. It tastes real citrusy. It looks bad, but it's not. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna take this color here now and put a little bit of that in the outer corner. I just wanna darken it up more. Hey, who are we babysitting tonight while mum's at Guns N' Roses? You? What happened to you? <laughs> she got fixed. She is so big since you guys were the last seen her. She's gonna get stuck in there. She got fixed a few days ago, by the way, so she's doing all right. She just got stitches. And she's still unco with her cone. How are you doing? She looks hilarious. <laughs> Indeed. All right, it is now 4.01 p.m. I've been editing all day long. Oh. That's not a cute screen shot. <laughs> anyway, um, I've edited a few videos and some thumbnails. Here's a sneak peek of some of the ones I did today. Oh, I didn't do that one today, but anyways, this is the video I'm editing right now. It's like a BB cream first impression, but I'm gonna go off to the hospital now for a bit and I'll come back later. I've got some mail to open, so I might do that and I think we're just gonna have a chill night tonight. Yes, I had eggs on it toast for lunch and it was uh, delicious with the avocado. I look so like washed out and gross. I'm feeling sorry for myself. Every time I'm on my period, I'm just like, poor me. Here's my really healthy dinner for tonight. It's like eight o'clock. Just got back a little while ago. It is a veggie, God, what is it? It's the apricot, pine nut, corn, cream cheese one. So good. Plus hot sauce. Yum, so good. I look like I've got giant hands. <laughs> I'm having another cup of tea, so I thought I'd open all of these while it is steeping or whatever the word is. This is so trippy. Brush on block SPF 30. It's like Louie. So the product's down the bottom and you must just like twist it. And then it's got a little brush. It's a really soft brush too. So you just like swirl it and it goes on. You can kind of see I didn't blend it out properly, but that's really cool. I'm excited to try that. You can kind of see it. I was sent some mellow stuff from a PR company, which I already have all this. I've done a video on it as well. If you want to check it out, just search NXO Mellow and it should come up. Zeus, it's not food, bud. It's not food, Zeus. Is it chocolate? Every single box, he's like, what is it? <laughs> is it chocolate? He wishes. You just had a bite of pizza, though. 
Should I just yeah, you did. Yeah. I thought you did. What did you give him? I gave him like oh, a chip. Half a chip. Oh, he got a chip. Listen, you greedy. You're so cute. Me and Hamish were just just discussing how Zeus so is the cutest that, um, dog in the entire world. And if you disagree, you're wrong. Is she breaking bed? Next, um, I got sent the Angel Muse, which I think this is the one Sally has been raving about, so I'm going to sniff it. And this is Zara Wanted. I haven't heard of this brand before. I think this one is men's because it smells like Hamish and it smells amazing. Tell me what you think. Mm, I don't know. Yeah, hey, I guess at the end of the day, does it even matter? Still, I don't know, you'll have to look it up. I don't know. Do you think it smells good? Yeah. Not that it matters, guys, because you can wear whatever you like, but it is a men's fragrance if you were con um, I mean, a little bit if you were wondering. Hamish likes it. It's, I reckon it smells really good. I like the bottle, it's different. The packaging's so bizarre. Obviously, normally, like, it would stand upright, but this one lies down. It's just flat. <laughs> oh, yeah, that does smell good. Oh, well, uh. Ooh. Hello. Do you like this? Smell it. No. Yeah, what is it? Um, it's called Angel Muse. It's quite a trippy shape in my hand, though. Yeah. Cool. I was just saying to Hamish, it's quite good because this would fit really good in like a travel toiletry bag. Like you could slide it in there. Like it's quite thin. I also got this. How do I open it? Oh my gosh, this is so much smaller than I thought it would be. I thought it would be like huge. Like I thought it was like as big as this box, but it's itty bitty. It's just like normal little eyeshadow size. I thought they were like highlighters. Let's do some swatches. Pretty, they're so pigmented. Look at when I like wipe it away. Very similar to like the Moonchild palette by ABH. I bought these. And Pussy Whipped Rich Blood, no, ta no Tea, No Shade, and Sagittarius. Here they are. So this one here is a princess cut. I don't know how I feel about these. Like I've got one. I don't know. I don't not like it, but... Oh, that one's actually prettier than the one I've got, I think. I guess because it's a lighter shade. I've got, I can't even remember which one I've got. Like the peach one, I think. Is it peach? This one's ice cold. Yeah, the lighter one seems to be nicer. And then this one's the gold one. I'm like in my underwear right now, so hopefully you don't see an accidental slip. Mm, I don't like the gold one as much, but on a darker skin tone it would look better. Now we found the proper chocolate. Yes, we did. You're not allowed to eat that because you'll die. Um, these are lip pencils. Here we go. These are the shades here. Pretty. I really, really like the Gerard Cosmetics lip liners too. They're nice and creamy. I got this a while back and then I found it in the cupboard because I put it in there. God knows why. Got sent some designer brands. Makeup remover. Collection Lasting Perfection Concealer and Fair. This is still one of the best formulas of concealer there is, I swear. And then this stuff was sent to me from Sephora. Studio 10. I've never heard of this brand. Your Best Angle Contour and Brighten Kit. And Contour and Color Eyes to Memorize. Oh, this one here is the Spray and Set Designer Brands. Got the Skin Glossing Pencil by Nude Sticks. And also a Lip and Cheek Color in Wicked. And Pulse. Didn't go to the gym today, but the cashier's name at McDonald's was gym, so same thing. Same girl. Switch your ass off, not your face. Hustle and glow. What's this? I don't know. Ooh, is it a Fitbit? Oh, a Fitbit. Cool. What is this thing? I'm so confused. Is it a Fitbit? It must be. That's so cool. It's like super cool looking. It's like a bangle. That's epic. Thank you, Tarte. Lifted mascara. Looks like some kind of bronzing stick. Brighter days and fresh eyes. Maracuja waterproof eye makeup removal wipes. I got distracted opening, I mean, watching Breaking Bad. So I'll continue opening the mail soon. Breaking Bad got real good. I wanted to show you my new toothbrush. <laughs> Because I'm all about that oral health life. I got the new, wait, no, this isn't new. I got a new Oral-B Brawn 
looks like this is not the most expensive one. I got it at Briscoe's, it was 20% off. And it's got a light on the back of it, which I'll show you. It like lights up when you're pushing too hard. I don't have that problem so much, but Hamish did. He pushed too hard on his gums. So it like trains you to brush gentler because you don't want to wear away your gum. Look. Got these, they're supposed to be even more offensive than Cards Against Humanity, so it should be interesting. <laughs> Bought myself some stuff, got a new black track, because mine is super old and I'm worried it's going to dry out, so I just caught, got it for like a backup. Free sample of strobe cream, which I already love, so good for travel. And then a bunch of lipsticks and a couple of those skin um finishes like the one i showed you the other day this is so pretty limited edition what is this high heels is this one of those retro mats oh yeah retro matte liquid lipstick celine dion sweet sweet fantasy yeah just some max stuff do you miss your mum tired little girl Look at your scruffy face. I terrified my mother that I might have it, so my father fell very ill when I was... Hi. Show everyone your underbite. Four or five. It's really so cute. Hard. Her bottom teeth stick out. It's adorable. Possible. Well, I got... This is business. so pretty. By Colourpop. I mean, telling you that you need to pay what you owe. Decision you made, by the way. So I don't understand why you're hectoring me about this. Hi. Are this you back? No, it doesn't. I'm telling you, you need to drop this. This is exotic. I have to pause and show you the toe beans. Look at the toes. Great Aunt Bergen. This is called Deja Vu. And this is called Lexi. And they are called the Blotted Lip. It looks like it's kind of like a sheer lipstick stain kind of formula. That's it there. Quite cool. And that's what it looks like once it's blended out. And then a little weapon and bare necessities. Satin lip and matte lip. Sip NZ Rose. Thank you. The Ned from Marlborough. Pinot Rose. I haven't tried this. And Middle Earth. Pinot. Oh god, how do you pronounce it? Got a Elizabeth Art and Calendar. Cute. I have a suspicion my mum will probably want to steal this off me. I'm guessing it's a calendar. And Elizabeth Arden's doing blush, blah, blah, brushes now. So this eyeshadow brush is 33 New Zealand dollars. And then the jewel end foundation brush is $57. Here's some info about them if you want to pause it. So out of it, it's like, I don't know, it looks so weird. I'm so intrigued. Bought some stuff off Winter, got some mousse, and I got some um, new shampoo and conditioner. Last one, this is a huge one, it was sent to my PO box, but the courier brought it to my house. Sweet. Shannon, welcome to the world's best female community. This is cool, this is a one litre BPA free bottle. I actually really like it. And a gym towel. Okay, I've got a crap load of stuff tonight. <laughs> I've like been slacking on the blogging, but hopefully you guys enjoyed what you saw anyway. I will talk to you guys again soon. Bye. Bye.